How could I have done such a thing? Oh, it's the white lady! All right, we're back with Martha is Dead, part two. I'm Hula Noob, and uh, we're about to make a photo. Well, we already did the photo. We took the photo, but now we will um, process it, like the analog way. Also, so this game is set in Italy, 1944. And um, because my history knowledge is embarrassing, you know, um, I... I'm not quite sure whether I outright said something wrong in the last part, um, but by 1944, basically the Allied forces from the West already had defeated Mussolini, so it Italy was not um, a Nazi country anymore. However, the north of Italy was occupied by the Germans. So I'm quite sure that we, because our family of our protagonist... Um, they are, well, the father is a Nazi, um, a leader. So I guess we're in the north of Italy. Maybe that's why they even went to this place in the first place after not being here for such a long time, because I think that was implied. So yeah, that's about it. <laughs> Just to, you know, I, I read up a little bit on it because I was very sure that I got it wrong. And I, I, I did. Daddy had this device brought here last week. It's old, but it still works. He has always loved everything technological. Okay, that warning on the bottom right is for um, electricity, so you can easily hurt yourself a lot. Oh, see, she's just doing it, so I can't do anything wrong. That would be nice. Choose the photo. Uh, to develop a photo, you'll first have to use the enlarger. The enlarger is an optical instrument that allows you to process photographic paper. Blop. After shooting a photo, the film must be developed in several steps. This aspect has been omitted for the sake of simplicity. Yes. Thank you so much, developers. I know there's probably people out there that complain about this because they want it to be finicky, but I... I Thank you. <laughs> but in reality, the steps are as follows. The film is firstly rolled on a reel and put inside a small tank. That tank is then immersed in the developer, washed and then immersed in a stop bath. It is then washed again, dried and finally cut. You find your rolls of film already developed and ready for printing. Because I did this in medium and I did not enjoy this because it's tedious to do this in a, in a video game. Nothing against people who actually do this in real life because that's probably really cool. Choose the image you want to print a paper. The preview on the left side will help you choose. Of course, you will see your images in negative. Of course. But yeah, of course. <laughs> well, I only have one picture, so let's do this one. The enlarger allows you to customize your photos even more. You can choose on which part of the paper the picture will be printed. You can adjust the focus and choose how long to expose the photographic paper. With the red filter, you can project and see the image on paper without exposing it. So probably the enlarging is for clues. So I also, I looked up, um, use the controls to move the paper on the bench and to adjust the magnification and focus. Yeah, you see, that's already... Oh. When the three circles are aligned, the picture is focused. If you still see the image out of focus when aligned, you probably shot it that way. Aw. Play with the... But we didn't, because I think we had all the points aligned as you did well, Hula. Play with the adjustment until you're happy. When you're ready, press space to continue. Oh, there's the... So that's the whole picture that we want. And that's... Okay. And A and D is... Okay. Uh-huh. <laughs> Shit. Damn it. Oh, there. It was better first. I made it worse. I'm sorry. I don't see the bird. That's weird. Shouldn't I see it? Even in... Inverted? Oh, well. Let's just hope for the best. Oh, there. Card out of position. What does that mean? Blip, 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 blip. 
card out of position. Oh, it's out of it's in focus. Um. Oh, I see. I see. I see. I see. And there you go. But that's totally fine. Oh, but now it's out of focus again. Okay. I got it. Bam. When the red filter is removed, the image is exposed onto the paper. This process has been automated and made faster than what happens in real life. Okay. So... Immerse the paper in the developer and the image will appear. Bleb. Oh. I thought we skipped that. That's what I was happy about. To achieve ideal exposure, take the paper out of the developer when the timer is in the green zone. If you take the paper out too early or too late, the picture will be ruined and you'll have to print it again. Ugh. Okay. That's like bomb diffusing in Evil Within. <laughs> Bam. In real life, immersion in the developer is followed by a wash, a stop bath, and then a second wash. These additional baths have been skipped for the sake of simplicity. Here's your printed photo. You can keep it in your album or scrap it. Not a bad photograph. It seems that the camera works perfectly. Now I can take a self-timed photo for Martha's frame. You can print each shot as many times as you like. All shots remain available to print at any time. Achieve when unlocked the Hierophant. Put it in the album. Bam. Okay. Well, that album looks a lot... You know, my, my bag looks a lot like a trash can. <laughs> there are three baths when developing photos. The development bath, then the first rinse, and then the fixing bath. The second rinse is done directly in the sink afterwards. Okay. Yeah, sorry, it's not super interesting to me. It's letters. Do we take those? Why not? I mean, why wouldn't we want to... God damn it, Julia. You're so boring. So yeah, I... I, um, I said that I wasn't too enamored with the first part. Or the first hour or two of this game. Because it was a little bit boring but i read that this is a game that's 10 hours long or maybe even longer and it will go wild so maybe that's why the intro takes its time still i i don't know i'm not sure whether the intro you know being a slow start is not the problem for me it's really the characterization of julia the is set up with the self timer she's boring like it works for games like medium you know, evil within if the protagonists are kind of ciphers, you know, with no real personality that I could my own personality into. But for a game like this, I, where I don't really, you know, I don't know, I, I would have preferred her to be a bit more of a person, of an individual with distinct personality traits, because so far she's very bland. And I think that's my problem. Because I like slow starts. Like, I'm a big Stephen King fan. And he is the master of drawing out the intro, pa uh, intro part of any story. Okay. Can I smile? Can I make a silly face? Yeah, let's smile. Let's be. Sulky is... Mm. Ah. Mm. Although, wait, I just lost my sister, I remember. <laughs> Maybe I should have made another one. Wait, what, 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 what is this? Can I make an... Oh, I can't. Okay, well, we messed that up. Have a happy face even though our sister is dead. Oh, man. Damn, I, I really forgot that. Even though that's the main plot of this game. Oh, well. Yeah, slow burn. I love it. To develop a photo. Well, you is can't it though? See anything at first, yet something invisible is captured on the black film. A kind of ghost. That invisible breath then returns to reveal the reality from which it was torn. There are those who say that photography steals the soul or captures it. 
That's why they used to photograph the dead. But nowadays, almost nobody does it anymore. Even if it's just a delusion, I want to photograph Martha. I want to have a small reflection of who she was with me. But I have to do it secretly or they'll think I'm crazy. Nowadays, no one does this anymore. Um, hello, Ryder. You know that your protagonist is set in 1944, right? Like, before smartphones and stuff, and people were, where they still had to develop pictures, you know? So, I don't know. Maybe I misheard. Okay, let's do this. Uh, that's nice. Yeah. But again. Me. No one was ever able to tell us apart. But I never had the slightest doubt, and nor did Martha. It's strange how what identifies us most deeply is not visible to anyone. The soul in the photo. But again, that picture looked nothing like all the pictures we saw. Like, it didn't I look like... I was obsessively thinking about Martha and what had happened. But suddenly, a thought took control. The memory of that day at the lake was becoming more and more like a dream when, after awakening, the image becomes more and more faded. Could it be that the memories were a figment of the mind? Had I been the one that hurt my sister? I had always envied her and now I had taken her identity. I experienced a suffocating pattern of thoughts. I decided to go straight to the lake to retrieve the film rolls. They would tell a different story, I was sure. Ooh, yes. But deep down, I kept hoping they would confirm my fading memory. <laughs> of course the door is locked. If the keys aren't hanging on the lock as usual, then they will be in Daddy's study. We live in fear now. My parents are not going to let me go to the lake anymore after Martha's death. So this is the right time. I need to know. The self-doubt I feel is eating me up. The rules! Now I'm hungry. Where do I have to go? So the study is probably um, upstairs. The lighter can be accessed from Julia's bag when not in use. Okay, what's this? Oh, it's a window. Oh my god, okay. That's my own room. Wait, where's that study? Is it... No, that's the kitchen. But wait, there's another door. Can I use this? No. Okay. Um... Oh, what's this? Why would I do that? I don't have the courage to use the phone. Not right now. But why would I even want to? Okay, now I have to use open... Oh, wait, what? what's, what's in my diary? July 18th. Everything has changed. I feel like a different person. The best part of me left with Martha. My enthusiasm, my desire to live, and the will to joke around. I find myself alone, left to my own devices, confused with no desire or expectations. I was handling the cameras at the lake and there was a floating body on the water. I don't remember what I was doing before. Yet another memory lapse. That lifeless body was Martha's, my sister. Mummy ran up to me and hugged me thinking I was Martha and that I, Julia, was dead. I didn't correct her mistake, and now it's too late. If they find out I've been fooling everyone, I don't even want to think about it. I feel terribly guilty pretending to be Martha, pretending to be death. I took the photo for Martha's frame. I know it's too late now, and I felt incredible pain placing the picture. I said goodbye to her forever in that moment. I realized she was gone, and there was no going back. I must do one thing for Martha. I must find out what happened. The partisans couldn't have killed her. That's just ridiculous. Lapo is my friend and he is one of them. He loved us so much. We know all of them. So it's just impossible. Oh, that's already okay. Okay. 
I don't get into the writing. I don't know why. It's I'm super sorry. It's not that I, you know, like I want to get into this, but uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But I don't have a it's film roll. I can't turn on the light. It's dangerous. I'll need a flash for the camera. I can look for it amongst Daddy's things in the room below his bedroom. Okay. And now use a little lighter. But where's Daddy's workroom? I don't. Oh wait! Oh, oh I'm a doofus. I thought that was di leading directly to my room, but no. Okay, that's the flashlight. Well, the flash. Sorry. Here's the camera flash. Now I can photograph Martha even in the dark. Okay. Daddy stuff. War maps. I've heard everything will play out on this new defensive line. That's all you have to say, Julia. I mean, you're not a child anymore, so... Okay. I guess keep on going ignoring what the heck your father is. Oh, there is the key. Do I want to look at some other stuff? Yes, I do. I know there's something about the writing. It's not bad. It's not bad writing. It just it doesn't engage me, and I think that's a personal issue. I I I'm very fin. I'm like, I'm so opinionated. I immediately know if I like something or not. So this is not on the developers and writers of this game. This is really just a very personal preference or lack thereof <laughs> okay oh I gotta sneeze in a second I think oh oh who's that <gasps> look Oh, there's nothing in there. I'm moving weirdly. I don't like how I move. I don't know why I'm moving like this. Is it because I'm... Sneaking? I don't know. So that's a lot of names. That's weird. Okay, look. Do you see that? That is not me being janky. That's the game being janky. Okay, let's go downstairs again. Come on. Do, 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 do. I'm too chipper. I'm sorry. The camera can be used in very dark lightning by attaching the flash. Yes. I'm too sh chipper to make a picture of my dad's sister. Okay. Bada bing. Bada boom. Subject partially framed. Oh wait. Oh my Okay. It's too much. It's too much. Wait, but why is it still too dark? Nothing changes, does it? Oh, oh, okay. Properly oh my god, that was quite alright. Okay, finally, oh, Jesus. It'd be nice to have you always by my side. Even if it's just a picture. It was probably explained in the first part of this game, but I don't... I'm not the kind of person who remembers stuff, I'm sorry. Which makes me very, um... Annoying to watch. Wait, hey. I guess. Okay. Hey, what's this? That's a coin. Or a button? Oh no, it's a lens. A lens okay. and a roll of infrared film. They can photograph what the naked eye cannot see. Oh shoot, I don't even... And another one. Okay. I wanted to go out. I didn't even want to do this. Let's do this later, because first we want to go out. And then we can finish this episode with uh, developing the images. And that can be like the thing, you know, that I do at the ending of every episode. 
Unless they last too long. I don't know how long time... How much time we'll spend at the lake. Um, okay, so let's go out. We haven't been to the lake. I mean, we've been to the lake, but not from this place here. So I don't know where to go. And I'm scared this will... <laughs> take me too long look this maybe no this is a huh. wait do I have a map I have a map oh, but I don't know how to read a map so... there's no lake at all <laughs> where the heck is the lake uh Is it just me to zoom out? Oh! What's that? That is scary. But I still don't see a lake. I see a river. Oh, there's the lake. Whoa! That is such a long way. Okay. Um. Wait, how do I... Yeah, maybe we'll not end with the developing of the film. <laughs> um, is this the right way? The forest is very dark. The lighter will not be enough. Better to use the gas lamp. Well, where's the gas lamp? Oh, there it is. Okay. Oh, thank God. I thought I had to look now. And it's very bright red. Yeah, it's on me. Maybe I'm just not the right person to play this game and really enjoy it. Because, like, everything I don't enjoy feels like something that's not... It's more a me problem. You know, I'm like, well, I prefer it to be different. Is this it? Sorry, I, I am so bad with maps. I'm really not good with directions. Oh yeah, but this is the right way, so this is cool. This would be also nice because it's like a labyrinth. Anything cool here? No. Oh, what's this? Oh yeah, that's the garage. Um. So, yeah. In my timeline, it's Monday. And it's... Oh. It's a shitty time right now, you know, with the war and everything. Being very close. I mean, it feels like it's been a shitty time for a while. You know, on, the, on a world level. Like, on, on a I personal night, level. But this night scares me. In the dark. I can feel all the harm I've caused. Why? It's getting closer with each step. I feel it brushing up against me like a cold wind. I hurt Martha. The closer I get to the lake, the more certain I am of this. How could it not be? I killed her to steal the love that everyone felt for her but didn't feel for me. How could I have done such a thing? Oh, it's the white lady! Anyways, on a personal level, I'm super fine. You know, I'm I'm very privileged. But just looking at the world, man, it's just it's not. It's getting worse, you know, with every single year. And then I think, well, maybe it was always like this. But because I'm so privileged, I never really noticed it as much. Um, A grave in this economy <laughs> sorry no <laughs> I'm so sorry but you know oh man the the B button it it's so far away from everything else okay oh I'm so far off I'm so sorry I'm so bad with maps and directions Ugh. yeah I think this whole game is just structured for someone else oh okay um B camera use the camera I don't know it's not as fun I mean it's not annoying but it's also not really fun but that's maybe because I'm playing I really think with the with the controller this is um, this would probably play a lot better this feels a whole like mouse and keyboard thing problem okay BAM German soldiers daddy ordered patrols to be carried out near the house but how could they have lost a helmet God only knows 
I don't know, I think losing a helmet is very likely opposed to like losing socks, you know? There was a time when I saw a lot of socks like on streets. I don't know if that's <laughs> something that happened to other people as well, but yeah. Maybe just hallucinations, me seeing ghost socks. Who knows? Okay, so... Are we on the... Yes, we are. Amazing. Amazing. Okay. I like this environment. And the sound design is also quite neat. Do we want to go there and see if there's something cool? I mean, she's scared, but I'm not. <laughs> oh. Okay, well... So, no points for exploration, I guess. Hmm. Just thought I would find something cool, like get a cool achievement or whatever. Reminds me of the game Blair Witch, but also Medium, which uh, were Hello. both by the same Damn lamp. developer. Look, I still have my lighter with me? Okay. That didn't really pack a punch. Oh, again? Okay. I was more surprised by her saying <gasps> than the actual white lady. Oh, it went out and she just put it on again. And that they all. They did that for the. <gasps> okay. Um, I think we're on the right path. The cameras are somewhere around here. Okay. Objective updated. There's a camera. Get it. Get it. Yes. Two cameras Ooh. left. Oh, is that? Sorry, is that a building on a house? Is that our house? No, it can't be. No, it's another house. Isn't there one here? No? Is that another building? That's so weird. You know, especially in European myths, you have the concept of Irrlichter, which are like basically lights that lead people into lakes or, you know, into whatever like holes and caves where they will meet their end it's basically like fairy lights but dark and sinister and Irrlicht translates to light but um, to collect. confusing light basically it's not a good it's not a clean translation but that's all you get from me for now There it is. Oh, what's that? The red thing. A shred of fabric here in the woods. How strange. Let's take a photo of it and leave it where it is. That's it. I've got them all. These films but are going to help me understand what happened. Now I should rush home to develop them. I hope I don't have to develop all the photos myself and can just skip that. Okay, so this time I don't need the flash because there's a light. Properly exposed. No, uh, it's. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, let's make it artsy. Mm hmm. I'm not in the mood to. There we go. How could it have okay. ended up here? It looks familiar. I would take it. If I would suspect that the it's maybe the murderer's fabric, I would absolutely take it because then I can, you know, this way I'm always like, well, it looks like the fabric, but I'm not quite sure it is the fabric, especially on an old photo. Um, but if I have it with me, I can be like, well, this is exactly the same fabric. Gotcha. A murderer. But apparently Julia is not really 
Well, she probably doesn't watch CSI, I guess. Am I going the right way? I don't want to look at the map too often because I know it's annoying. But I also don't want to get lost too much. Julia. Julia. Yes. <laughs> oh no, white lady. Not very creepy, sorry, white lady. Oh, there's now... Wait, can I? Oh, I can. So she's running, but I steer the wheel. Oh shit, I don't know. Oh. Ooh, a quick time event. Well, yeah. I don't know the direction. Bloop. Did I not make it? That... That looked and sounded like I didn't make it. Okay, let's do this again. Whoa! Aha! Uh -huh. hmm. Oh no, she's getting tired. And slurry. Oh my god, and now she's in war trenches. And now she's a horse. <laughs> Sorry. That's not. Ooh, I like this. Ooh, that looks pretty. Yes, make this a witch story. Turn it around. I don't want a white lady. I want a witch. A creepy witch. Oh, this is nice. I like the different sized skulls. Like, everything out of proportion. I love it. Oh, cool. Okay. Oh, I'm very small. I'm a kid. Oh. that? Oh, she's pregnant? Because all the faces look always different in photos and pictures. They always look different. I don't know who was there, the hanged person. Was it Martha or me? Or it's someone completely different. I can't tell. Oh, do I have to do something? I could move around, but... What? Yeah, I'm psychological horror. <laughs> It can be amazing. Oh, yet if it's one. good, it's amazing. She entered my dreams once more. Maybe she wants to talk to me. Also, look, what you. What am I saying? Fairy tales coming true. Your bed. Feel... No, no, these are the thoughts of a crazy person, and I'm not crazy. Look, the bed. It's all. Whoop. <gasps> Was she pregnant? Damn it, what's all this blood? I'm not due yet and there's a lot more than usual. What's happening to me? Am I going to be joining Martha sooner than I thought? I have to wash up and do what needs to be done. 
If I'm sick, I have little time. The truth awaits me. It must be hidden within those walls. Oh, jeez. New chapter, the words. Three days after Martha's death, 10.30 a.m. You know what? You know, I will not end this with the photo thing. I will end this with chapters. I think that's the best. So, yeah. Second chapter, I think. <laughs> um, the roles. And I'm still not fully on board. Like, I, of course, I do want to know what happened. I want to know what happened to Martha. Absolutely, 100%. And I want to know how this game plays out. But still... As of now, I'm not fully on board. I'm not fully immersed. I don't really identify with Julia. I still think she's somewhat of a bland character. Um, and the horror elements, so far, I was not scared. It's, it's not my... I feel like this is, you know, one of those things where I get it why other people like it. But it's not my thing. It's like this um, Room 14... 80 something by Stephen King the movie with John Cusack you know and I love and, and or the movie Dead Silence by James Wan I think everyone loves it I don't get it <laughs> I just don't get those movies I'm like well eh and I'm like yeah I'm like I'm like this with the game um but it's still it's entertaining like you know I'm not bored like I played 45 minutes in this chapter and it wasn't boring once Except the diary entry that was very long and kind of, you know. But other than that, like, I, I like playing the game and it doesn't feel like a chore playing it um, overall. So, yeah, I'm, I'm still waiting for everything to click. I think that's just what, you know, it's, it's like, yeah, something needs to happen for me to get really invested in it. And it, it hasn't yet happened. And as I said, throughout this whole Let's Play, it might be a me thing, you know, a very subjective taste thing. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this nevertheless. Like, I will still continue this. Um, and I still think it's a, it's a good game. Um, I mean, you know, I guess it is. I can't really tell because we haven't played it through yet. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. And if you're new to this channel, but that would be weird because on episode two, well, you know, who knows? Uh, you are free to subscribe. I'm uh, happy to welcome you. And I promise you, if I'm the white woman in the forest, I will not scare you. I will be like, here's the way home, honey. <laughs> That's my promise. So subscribe. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you had a good time. I hope you have a wonderful day and maybe see you soon. Bye. This is my self-recorded outro song so I don't get hit with copyright claims. If you subscribe, you subscribe to a lot of fun tutorials, reviews and let's plays.